Joe Coogan, that's a pretty bird, isn't it? It sure is, John. I'll tell you, this early season uh, pheasant up in South Dakota has been outstanding, and these birds are just as beautiful and mature as they can be. Yep, you know, it's a good hunting party. A lot of people, well, everybody used good uh, uh, safety the whole time. Everybody had their muzzles up, and uh, they were uh, keeping their shells separate, and that's real important. I know uh, in your years of hunting, you probably seen some people use some uh, bad tactics in the field, and uh, maybe you have a few words of advice for yeah. folks when they go out pheasant hunting this year. Well, I, I think, uh, particularly pheasant hunting, where you've got a, a, you know, a number of people involved, you've really got to be safety conscious. It gets exciting when you know the birds are getting up, and sometimes you can lose track of where your buddy is, the guy to the left and right. Always, always maintain uh, as much visual contact with the other shooters so that you don't swing into anybody. Obviously, low shots. Uh, if you do take one, you've got to be absolutely certain nobody's in front of you. And the best thing, of course, is not to take one. Right. Make yeah, sure that that bird's up in the air, and then you don't ever have to worry about uh, you know somebody being on the other side of it. Right. You got to show restraint once in a while. I think of it a lot like baseball. When you're playing baseball, you got to know what's what you're going to do, and that ball comes to you to which base you're going to throw it to, That's right. what you're going to do exactly. Same thing with pheasant hunting. You got to know what you're going to do when that pheasant jumps up. Well, you've got to think ahead. Mm -hmm. You've got to think ahead. You've got dogs working. Watch the dogs. Listen to the dog handler. He's a guy that knows the country. He knows what he's doing. He's going to be the one that's, you know, letting you know that a dog's on point or whatever. You know, move up, hold back, whatever, whatever you need to do. So, listen to him. Use him as a reference. Uh, if you lose track of where the other shooters are, you know, shout out. Say, hey, I'm over here. Where are you? Right. So safety, safety, safety. There, there's just no substitution for it. Right. So we can live again to hunt again, huh? That's right. <laughs> In South Dakota, this is John Geiger with Game and Fish Magazine and Joe Coogan of Benelli.